Well, we know 2020 has our nonprofit spread thin. And with today being Giving Tuesday, there is no better time to give to those in need. News Channel 5 Cena Sleem spoke with some Nashville area charities about how your dollar can make a big difference. This year, nonprofits are dealing with fewer donations, but increased demand. That's why Giving Tuesday is so important this year. 2020 has tested the resilience of families. The pandemic and the tornadoes have been just a double whammy for everybody in Middle Tennessee. And we've seen an, about a 50% increase in need of families, children, and seniors that are now food insecure. Some who have lived comfortably are now finding themselves needing help for the first time. We were giving away about 76,000 diapers a month. And then after the tornadoes and the pandemic, we increased to about 200 and 20,000 diapers a month and need really increased because families were losing their jobs and couldn't send their kids to daycares. In order to keep up with the demand for services like finding shelter. Safer at home is not safer for everyone. We have seen a significant, mm -hmm. significant increase of those who have called to ask for help. Nonprofits need your help. Nonprofits live and breathe based on how well the community is receptive and gives back. One report showed that nonprofits across the country could be losing as much as 20% of donations they expect to get in a year. Organizations have been forced to cancel their fundraising events because of the pandemic. That's why Giving Tuesday isn't simply about donating money, but uplifting our community. A very important day. Uh, nonprofits are stretched very, very thin. We have a lot of people that are suffering in the community. As we know, the economics have worked against us. Uh, so we really have to make sure that we support those nonprofits in our community that are lifting people up. In Nashville. We got a lot of work to do to, to serve our community. Sina Sleem, News Channel 5. Thanks, Sina. If you want to learn more about any of these organizations mentioned, please go to newschannel5.com.